Um, it is St. Patrick's Day, so I hope you've had the luck of the Irish with you today. Um, funny story before I get started about uh, St. Patrick's Day. This is my favorite holiday. Um, and I, I think it's just because I love Ireland so much and I'm Irish pretty much and stuff like that. But when I was younger, probably about eight or nine, I was at church in Sunday school and uh, our Sunday school teacher went around the room and she's like, what's your favorite holiday and why? <laughs> And, um, everybody pretty much said, oh, Christmas is my favorite holiday, Easter is my favorite holiday, and, uh, she got down to me, and I was like, St. Patrick's Day is my favorite holiday, and it is like, time stood still, she's like, why? And I told her that I loved the movie Darby O'Gill and the Little People, and <laughs> And she was just like, okay, okay, yeah, okay. So, that's my funny story for today. Um, I'll wear green eyeshadow today, like bright green eyeshadow, but it's already worn off because I've been up since forever this morning. Um, I weighed in at 186.6 this morning. I'm cooking dinner. Uh, we're going to have taco salad, and while that simmers, I am going to go get on the treadmill, and then um, I'm going to go to the tanning bed, and come back and finish cleaning out my closet. So, yeah, and I've worked all day long, too, so um, I've been really busy today, and I busted my ass at work. It's like everybody there, they weren't doing shit today. And I was doing it all, and it really pissed me off. But anyway, um, let's see. I got a question from Martha. Hey, Martha. Um, about how, how I eat right now, and do I really have to think about it, and am I at a place in my life right now where um, I don't have to think about what I eat. I just go with the flow and feel natural about it. And um, I answered her back and I thought this would be a good topic for a video. Um, pretty much the only time I think about food now is in the morning when I'm getting up and drinking my coffee, getting ready and planning what I'm going to eat for the day. And, um, I mean, I'll plan my breakfast and my lunch, whether, you know, I'm going to take my lunch with me or go out and eat with a friend or whatever. And, um, you know, when I get home, I, I pretty much eat beans or cottage cheese or something easy like that, you know, since I've stopped eating by 7 o'clock now. And, um, and that's it. I never think about food. And... You know, I think about it, and it's really liberating, because I told her that before, when I, when I was eating lunch, I would think, hmm, what am I going to eat for dinner? And now, it's just like, I don't care. Eating is such a pain in the ass now. All it is now is fuel for my body. And true, I do get hungry now, and when I get hungry, I eat something, and then, you know, it goes away. And, like, now I know when I'm truly hungry and when I'm not. You know, before, I used to read in magazines, um, ask yourself if you're really hungry before you eat. And I used to do that, and the answer would be, yes, I'm starving. And I usually was. And, um... Uh, but now that I've had surgery, I can control my hunger and my head and stuff like that. And I can actually ask myself now, hey, are you really hungry? And most of the time the answer is no. Um, so, you know, I just find something to drink then and the feeling is past. 
Um, so yeah, I, I thought that was a great question. And um, it's really nice that my life doesn't revolve around food. You know, I can take it or leave it now. Um, what else? I just saw Amelia's video, and I think it's really weird because yesterday I uh, dug out some of my old clothes too that has been in storage forever that I was saving up until I could wear them. And uh, I, I got tons of stuff out, and I'm I washed them, and uh, I'm about to dry them now, and I can wear mostly well I can wear everything. <laughs> and some of those clothes. I'm like, why the hell was I saving this? No, no, I'm never wearing this. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Um, I ate late last night and pretty much every night this weekend since Friday night. Um, so, I mean, we went out on a date Saturday night, and uh, we ate really late, and I uh, don't remember what went on Friday night, and I ate, like, a little bit after 7 o'clock last night. But, you know, it, it didn't hurt me, but I'm not going to get back in the habit of eating after 7. So, it is 6.30 right now, and I'm cooking, and I'll be eating before 7. Um, what else, what else, what else? It seems like there's just been so much going on. And then again, really not anything at all. Um. I don't know. Um, if I, if I think of something, I'll let y'all know. Um, I feel like I'm gonna be wasting y'all's time right now. Um, so yeah. I know there was something I was going to talk about, but I cannot remember. Um, if you have any questions for me, like Martha did, just let me know. And, you know, I'll answer them the best I can, because um, I'm here to help you. And uh, I want to help you. I want you to succeed in everything. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go and do all this stuff. And... Uh, try to get some stuff done around here because I am going to Amelia's again this weekend. Yay! I'm so excited. Anyway, um, I will talk to you later.